Hey guys I am back with another video, and it's a new video, in this video, I would be analyzing Bad Buddy the series, so I am going to talk about episode 2, and will compare it with the novel. So let's begin so in the novel version, both Pran and Pat already knew. They live in the same dorm, and they live right next door, not like they live opposite in the series version, so the whole scene of them assuming the neighbor is hitting them didn't exist, in short, the whole episode doesn't exist in the novel, both characters don't play any musical instrument, so there is no such reference of them playing any instrument in the novel, and there is no such thing as the freshy day, which also doesn't exist in the novel, and there is not much reference to the school life so this scene also doesn't exist in the novel, where Pran has suddenly left the school so this scene doesn't Exist it was Pat who falls in love with Pran's first, but in the series, it's Pran who had a crush on Pat from middle school, it's still not clear but according to the series synopsis it's clear Pran had a crush on Pat, Nong Hom looks different so the thing I am so salty that Nong Hom still doesn't have many references to Nong Hom, because he kinda plays a major role in the series, and Nong Hom is supposed to look like a bunny with fur, Pat. Can't sleep without him and due to specific fragrance Pat haven't washed him for 10 years. And Pat needs Pran or Nong Hom only then he can sleep properly, I really want them to. Explain how much Nong Hom means to him, it also shows the personality of Pat's characters. That how he have tough boy personality but deep inside he is still a soft guy, who like to. Wear teddy printed shorts, and needs a teddy bear to sleep, and the thing I am saltier. That they made Nox character a complete asshole like he is one of my favorite character in the novel. He is the most matured friend that Pat has. He is mostly calm and doesn't talk a lot. He gave Pat really good advice, and Pat can easily rely on Nock. But the series Nock is immature, always starts a conflict. So far he just totally opposite from the Nock. And I also do not like that scene when Pat's friends was just knocking at Pran's room just Imagine if you are a boy or girl and random people started to aggressively knock at your door and howling it would be terrifying as hell. All my thoughts I really like they had changed a lot of scenes but I really want some major scenes from the novel should be in the series and I really want Pat to proudly say that he is gay because in the novel there are so many occasions he is saying he is gay and that's one of the reasons I have read the novel. I really like that scene. When Pran's friend How didn't have any problem with the idea that Pran is getting hit by a guy, and they were shipping them. So far I really like Pran's friend because they don't start a fight it's always Pat's friends I think this episode really shows the personality of two clans how Pran's gang is more open minded, rarely starts a fight, and it's Pat's gang who usually starts a fight they are more narrow minded, and basically ill mannered. Nanan's acting in this episode was superb like his eyes speak 10 times more emotions I really felt his pain, and first I really thought the dialogue was out of place due to Pat's dad just saying how their family is always jealous it should have made Pran's angry instead of sad, but after I read the synopsis I think he became so sad due to he has a crush on Pat at that time, Pran have to leave the school due to his parents, and I think he intentionally left that guitar bag so Pat can keep it, and I think Pran wants Pat to owe him something, so they will be close due to that at least, and I really like that they had changed few scenes in the novel they had already not enemies but not friends type of relationship, but in the series, they are slowly establishing that relationship. So I am really excited for further episodes.